Hi there. Um, so welcome to my vlog where um, this is my entry for the Mark Warner Mum competition and uh, to become the ambassador for the brand. Um, <clears throat> What um, I thought I'd do is something a little bit different, which is related to my website. So um, I'm Mrs. Mummy Penny, and my website is all about sort of saving money, getting the best value for your money um, with anything in life. So we all want to save a little bit of money when we go on holiday. We like to we like to um, spend money on our holiday, but maybe save the pennies a little bit um, on the things we're gonna take on holiday or the planning we do for a holiday. So I'm gonna show you my top 10 essentials for saving money on holiday. Um, I'll flash up a picture of my 10 things, and then I'm gonna go through them one by one. So uh, first of all, and I'm gonna bring them over and show you what they all are. So first of all, you see this bubble bum seat? Um, these, you can pick these up for about 20 pounds on eBay. Um, they, um, so that's inflated. It comes in a little bag um, and it squishes right down um, and you can take it on as hand luggage. Now, um, this is gonna save you so much money with car seats when you're going abroad. Um, so get this on eBay for 20 quid as opposed to uh, maybe 40, 50 pounds higher of a car seat in your higher car when you go abroad. So um, these are really, really good. Um, my second thing is um, a really great cheap toy to take with you on holiday. Right, so couldn't actually find any balloons. So I printed out some balloons um, and in black and white, it wouldn't print in color, I don't know why. Um, great thing to pack in your luggage. Uh, a really cheap toy to keep the kids amused, bashing that around the hotel room or the apartment, um, and it's gonna cost a few pennies. Um, the other um, great thing we always take with us is, oh, so we've got a sticker book, um, some pens, and a coloring in book. Um, great for early evenings, just to keep the kids happy. Um, it's just, and it's, it doesn't take up much room in the luggage, it's not that heavy. Um, the other things that relate to that is I'm gonna just reach over for things now, so I will be back. Uh, is a pack of cards. Gotta have a pack of cards to uh, keep everyone amused um, with games after dinner and in the evening. I always seem to take a selection of animals. Um, so my boys are nine, seven, and four. Um, so I suppose it's one more one for the younger ones, but these are great because you can chuck them in the bath, you can have them in the swimming pool, they're quite light. Um, just a really nice little toy for the kids to take, to have a play with. Uh, another thing which we always buy when we're out there because that's a bit big to put in your luggage um, a football for the beach uh, so three boys um, they're all obsessed with football as is their dad so we have to buy football when we're out there so we head to the little um, the closest shop to our apartment and buy football first thing we do um, the other things I wanted to talk through was um, essentials um, for, for the whole family really, and, and actually some quite important things. Um, so, cheap sunglasses. Don't take expensive sunglasses on holiday with you because they get scratched with sand, they get sat on, they fall in the water, so get some cheap sunglasses. Um, also, get a cheap little um, document holder like this. This, I think, oh, this is years and years old. Um, cost maybe like five, eight pounds for accessorise. It's perfect size for all the passports, keep your money in it. Um, really important just to keep all your documents together. And like how cool a colour is that? Baby wipes. I don't know how I lived without baby wipes. Bit of a strange one. Um, pack a couple in your um, luggage. Maybe, maybe one pack, because they're quite heavy I suppose. And, Weight is always important when you go on holiday. Um, but yeah, 
just for any emergencies when you run out the toilet roll. We all can't live without baby wipes. And then the last thing I wanted to talk about was um, a couple of cards. So here, we've got your European health insurance card. You have to make sure you've got these when you go on holiday in Europe. So they last for like, so mine, I've got them for the whole family. I've had them for about three or four years and they expire in 2020. So they last a really long time. If anything happens to you, they'll treat you in the hospitals um, if you can show them these cards. So really important to get, and they're free. Um, the other last thing, which is a great little money saving tip for um, your spending uh, when you're out on holiday, this is a Halifax Clarity card. Um, you will get the best rate of um, currency exchange when you use this card when you're abroad. So I've got it, I only ever use it when I'm on holiday um, for my spending, so I now I guarantee you get the best rate. Um, and then as soon as I get home, pay it off um, so it doesn't cost me any money, which it saves me a lot of money. So these are really handy to get. So um, there's all my um, money saving top tips for a great holiday. Um, I've written about lots of other ideas on my website as well, but um, I'd love to um, be an ambassador for my order and go on one of those lovely, lovely holidays that save all my pennies with all the um, things that I like to take with us and do when we're out there. So I um, hope you enjoyed it and um, I look forward to um, looking at all the other entries and seeing who the winner is. Bye!